Good morning. Let us begin in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today's Gospel reading finds Jesus with his disciples on his third recorded mission to Galilee. Here we see him send out the twelve to do exactly what he does. They are given power over evil forces and to heal sicknesses. They are also to proclaim the good news of the kingdom. They are to carry nothing extra with them as if they were taking a journey. Jesus said, take nothing for the journey neither walking stick, nor sack, nor food, nor money, and let no one take a second tunic. It is expected that hospitality will be extended to them in the traditional way of the Middle East. Try that one in our modern times. You wouldn't make it too far into the journey. Jesus told them not to be choosy about where they are received, but rather they had to stay in the first house that accepts them, and in the places where they and their message and their services are not welcome. They are told to shake the dust off their feet. This was a symbolic act which the Pharisees practiced when they left an unclean Gentile area. In this case, the act signifies that people are not just rejecting the disciples, but God himself, whom they bring with their message and their healing. The same mission is entrusted to each one of us. Although it will obviously be adapted to our life situation. We are called, individually and in community, to proclaim the gospel by word and deed. We are called to help liberate people from the negative forces at play in their life, addictions of all kinds that can enslave so easily. We are called to be sources of healing and wholeness. And for this, we do not need to be part of the medical profession. We are called to live lives of simplicity, using only those things which we need for life and work and rejecting all superfluity and luxury. This is something to ponder. Amen.